Hey, Scott Carter here. Thanks for coming back to my channel. I recently just finished some illustration work for a company called Forgotten Legends. They're a trading card video game. You can find their website and Kickstarter below. Uh, that's ForgottenLegends.org. And uh, the illustration that I did was in the style of Fang Zhu. You can check out his YouTube channel below as well. Uh, but let's get right to it. Okay, so I start with um, some thumbnail sketches. Uh, as you can see, I started uh, with a few of them already. Uh, the speed is uh, anywhere between 5 and 20,000 times faster than the original speed. Um, I think the whole thing took about like uh, about 30 hours or so for both illustrations. Uh, I end up with two. Uh, so I have uh, several here. I believe I have eight sketches. Um, at, at this point, I'm just kind of going over um, the old sketches. I was I, I put them down to a lower opacity and then kind of rendered out rendered them out a little bit more. So yeah, at this point, I I chose the three that I like most. Um, along with um, the uh, uh, the company that uh, is having me do this illustration for them, uh, we kind of chose them together. So these were the three that I picked, uh, and originally I was going to end up with one. I was laying down some color palettes, some imagery to kind of get the mood and the color palette that I was going to use, and then I kind of picked the colors from there and kind of painted over into it. Um, and it helps. It helps. Get, it helps uh, give the illustration some uh, some grit, some tooth uh, to kind of paint over uh, as well. Um, so now at this point, I'm just kind of uh, uh, creating more of an atmosphere and uh, just adding in some of the the, the, the bigger shapes um, and and just a little bit of detail here and there. Uh, I'm kind of just going through each one still still determining which illustration I'm going to um, uh, render out completely. Uh, so at this point I was only going to do one, but then um, uh, later on uh, the, um, the company decided they wanted two illustrations. Uh, so we did end up choosing uh, two of these three. At this point you can see that I'm splitting them up uh, into two illustrations and from this point on uh, I start render the, rendering them out uh, fully. Uh, on, the on the left, you'll see that um, I'm only doing the top one. At this point, I wasn't sure I was going to do both until I was finished with that with that uh, the left one there at the top. Uh, so that's why you see both of them there. Uh, but then at the, on the right, you can see only the other one as I finished that after I completed the, the one on the left. Uh, the one on the left is a red fire wyvern. Uh, and the one on the right actually happens to be a an undead version um, and which happens to be uh, uh, poison as well so it's a poison wyvern um, and yeah so then at this point I just continue uh, putting in details using some photo elements um, and uh, just kind of add, adding in details reshaping things uh, things that I don't think work I'll get rid of uh, or I'll change um, and you, you'll see I'm adding some photo uh, textures as well such as the dragon scales um, you'll notice earlier I used um, some textures from iguanas and other lizards uh, for their for their skin and things like that um, yeah, so you can see that I'm kind of changing things and, and adjusting things Uh, on the one on the left, you can see that you know I, I was rendering out uh, this stone structure, shaping it out. Uh, I wasn't sure how I felt about it, so I'll get back. I'll, I'll go back to it, and I wanted to 
render out some of the, the stone work. On the right you'll see that the, uh, the shape of, of the leg, the position of the leg and the neck wasn't working for me. At a certain point, um, the composition is basically where I need it to be, and I'm just adding in detail um, and add, you know adding in uh, pushing things back in the atmosphere, adding in textures, uh, and then painting over those textures. Uh, and uh, I pretty much have uh, the composition and things in the position that I need them to be. Um, it's just a matter of really rendering it out completely. You can see that I'm adding in the, uh, the stone textures on the right side. Um, um, you, you notice that I added that cabin in. The cabin is, uh, uh, I thought it, it helped a lot with the composition, so um, I, I just threw that in there. I decided to go on the left one, I decided to go with some sharp stone terrain instead of adding those structures, the stone structures. They weren't working, uh, they were kind of clashing too, uh, so I just kind of added in the basic, uh, uh, just the basic landscape, but added a little bit of uh, jaggedness to it to kind of go with the, uh, the aesthetic of the dragon, or sorry, of the wyvern. So yeah, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and check out the finished product and we'll see you on the next one. Enjoy.